sort of did that thing again and broke down when driving. And not good. At least it's a small car so people can get around us easily. But yeah, about that. It's not your battery. It's not your battery yet, I should say. Yeah. Um we can always pop start it, but roll back down the hill and do it. Well, I would say if you can turn the car around, then you can push me down the hill and I can pop start it. You want to just go back home at this point, or what? Uh, what are you thinking? And take the Subi, or do you want to just try and get this to Walmart? Um, well, we have kind of more trips to do after just Walmart, so yeah. we should probably just take it home. Yeah. You are good on that side if you want to just do a UE at this point. Is this is the problem that we want to fix? What, is this what guy the doing? fuck? Is he doing a U turn? What the hell is that maneuver? They're driving worse than us. This is uh, the problem that we're trying to fix. Be careful on that. Yeah. And um, yeah, little little bit of an issue. Music review, only one call away. Let's be honest, dude. Who calls these days? Everybody's texting or Snapchatting, man. What's that song about? Okay, so, um, still driving her. This is further in. I'm gonna check the engine, and not really for myself, but more for, more so for you guys because you'd actually know what to listen for. But we're just gonna make sure uh, thermostat housing is stayed on and everything. No leaks there, that's good. Caleb knows way more about these than me. Like, on a scale of one to 10, I'm at like a solid five. He's at like a solid like nine or 11. Radiator last I checked was high. Temps on the car are running good, so that's good. It sounds like it's running decent. Um, that's the idle speed, but I still, I'm not completely comfortable. I feel like this problem is gonna come back. So I'm really hoping somebody can comment with some insight on what's, look at this, disgusting. I'd like to keep my car pristine. And I'm still not sure if it's the sub or not. I really, I don't know. My review, false music, then bang your car. I'm gonna check this sub up for Jake. Oh, you guys see that? I think it might be the app. That's all the way up. Her sub, I'm sorry. From the outside. All right, check it, guys. First thing, sir, stress in peace, Uncle Ben. It is running good at this point, but that does normally happen. It doesn't run into issues until a little bit of time and normally to driving. So, um, Q's at a neutral right now. You can already see it's idle and lower. What I have heard from Caleb, though, it is supposed to naturally run at about... 800 for an idle is like natural so we'll see the other thing I'm thinking too I don't know if this could have anything to do with it but perhaps my sub is draining the energy because I do have really nice speakers in there and I don't know if that could do it but <laughs> Doesn't seem to really be affecting it right now, but I'm gonna be pissed off if I get copyrighted for the first song that I was playing because that one was horrible and that would be like the worst song that you copyrighted for. So um, yeah, it's idling decent. Um, we're gonna keep on driving it until something bad happens or until I'm comfortable with it. So. You guys get to see me drive stick while recording on a phone. And the hand swap clutch in second. Wow, like a pro. Like a pro, guys. 
Uh, I, I can't downshift out here though. I don't want to downshift back down. <laughs> This is this is um, manual problems, but there are way more many manual benefits than there are issues to anybody looking up on the manual. So um, yeah, we're just gonna continue to drive around the neighborhood and just keep on checking idle speeds. I don't really know exactly what to even look for, so I guess that's once again where you diehard Mata fans come in, because you would know this stuff a lot better than me. No, I can't even make this light up more. I was trying to make it more easy for you guys to see, but um, yeah, we're just gonna be cruising. My arm is tired. I should have stuck with the excuse that I couldn't record for you guys because I was driving manual. But now it's too late. Other thing too that's pretty cool. Uh, my odometer is a little, just a little off. The the big one that counts like the actual miles is good, but the one we can reset per tank is I'm pretty sure it's a little messed up because I go about I think I calculated it and it's I go a mile about a mile a second 1600 uh, miles per second like I'm at 271 right now I'm gonna track back up in about a second and we're gonna see where she's at okay first clutch and anybody who doesn't know, another reason I really wanted to buy this car is this was the first car I learned manual on. So there's like, there's memories here for me. You know, I feel like I owe it to her to stick with her through this, you know, and make her healthy again. You know, she taught me, now it's time for me to teach her. And when you drive a manual, you just like, you feel the car, you know, and it's just a lot better experience because you feel like you're one with the car, if that makes sense. You know, if it needs to be, up, be it running at higher RPMs or get shifted, you feel that, you know that, and that's you who's responsible to do that. On an automatic, it's just like you don't know anything that goes on behind the curtains. And relatively to what actually happens in a car, even driving manual, you still really don't know that much. But still, you guys get what I'm saying. It's the feeling that's super cool of driving a manual. We're gonna stop over here and get some loud music loaded up again, unless somebody randomly shows up behind me. Make sure it's still not the sub. Ooh, it's moving a little bit now. It's starting to. I wonder if that fuel cleaner is going to get in there. I'm going to change all my presets so I don't get copyrighted. Good sprint one. Oh, I like being walked all over lately. Walked all over oh, lately. I'd rather be quiet. Gonna pull in a little coldy sack and um, just see what see what happens there. Like a neutral again. That is first. I hope it feels like it could possibly be third. We will find out. Cool. That was first. That's good. All right. And swap clutch in shift. Good. Why did I shift right before a stop sign? Can anybody explain that to me? That's just stupid on my part. And this guy's still following me, are you kidding me? Dude, go somewhere else. This is a big neighborhood. Unbelievable, I swear. You try and get a loan from people and it's like impossible to find. Sorry you guys are seeing the steering wheel half this video, but give me props for actually vlogging and driving manual with one hand because that's, some people would say it can't be done, but I'm doing it right now. Yeah, we're gonna get somewhere where I can pull over and just let her idle for a little bit. Hover. I'm not gonna pull over on the side of the street because um, if you guys have watched some of my other videos, you know that I enjoy rapping occasionally from time to time with my friends. And since I live in like a very uh, suburban neighborhood, if you park up on somebody's street and sit in your car for more than 10 minutes, the cops will be called on you. So <laughs> I've been in the car with my friends and had so many cops come. They always come in like squads of four too, which I really don't get. I think they're just super bored around my area. But um, they'd come so many times in one month that I asked them, I'm like, do you guys have my car on record? Cause like, you've, you've come to me 
a shit ton. I didn't say that, but I said, you know, you guys have, like, came to my car and got a ton of calls this month on me. Like, you know there's nothing going on. And they're like, yeah, we have you in the records. So, needless to say, if you're in, um, what you would call a very, uh, very white, I don't know if that's politically correct, but if you're in, like, a neighborhood like this, don't park up next to people's houses. They tweak out really fast, and it's, it's, it's uncool. So, new Durango. Nice. I like the old body style better, but those things are pricey as hell, so I gotta say nice to the guy so he doesn't feel like he just wasted 70 grand. Given if he got the SRT8, if he got the other ones, it's whatever, but... Um, yeah, so this is where we're posting up, and we are gonna see how she idles. Music. No music. No music. Ooh, I felt her shaking more there. I don't know. She was shaking a little bit more. When I had that, that was pretty damn close to full volume too. Keep that in mind. If any of you guys have had like nice subs in your car and had this problem, maybe leave me a comment, but I, I don't know. Cause when the sub's not on, it's running there. We're gonna go music again and see. I wanna get some rap so we get some bass so the sub's actually working hard. Trying to be lately. <laughs> That is interesting. That seemed to have some effect on it. I don't know. You guys are gonna be the commenters, but this is a pretty cool video. We get to listen to like, that's either John Mayer or Jack Johnson, I forgot, but get to listen to some cool music and um, watch how it affects my RPM gauge. That's like a cool little science experiment. Unfortunately, there's no, no hard like gangster rap going on right now. Let me try 92.3. Oh, do I? I have two of the same, same presets. We're about to change that. Uh, anybody know any good stations to leave a comment? Is it 96.3 supposed to be rap? I like that new song, Bad Things. Okay, alright, here's 92. Wait for the bass drop. I, I gotta keep the music out till the bass drop for copyright. Alright, wait, 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 wait for it. Come on, how long are they gonna take? Holy cow. Alright, wait. Is it? Uh, oh my god, this is taking too long. <laughs> okay. Alright, we're gonna go loud. Holy cow, little Wayne goes in on this though, I give him that. Wait, 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 wait for it. Okay. I don't know. This is a tough one. Little Wayne got better at rapping, and Birdman was like, stole his ideas and tried to steal the Carter Five and wouldn't release it. And Little Wayne's like, all right, I'm stopping rapping. And then the next day at Drake's concert, he was like, JK, I'm back in and I'm coming in better than ever. And that's exactly how that shit went down. This is me with this car. <laughs> Now there are people in their garage that are probably looking at me. So, I don't know what it is. It hasn't died out. I'm gonna maybe try and drive it on some harder roads, maybe. Drive it a little bit faster. I'm gonna put the phone down then. You guys already got a long enough video, you probably hate me, so...
We made it home. It's still running. No shutdowns. Wow, I'm yelling. God, I'm dizzy too. So leave me some comments. Let me know your opinions. Little fun fact for you. The other day, I went to go get in the car and I looked at my exhaust and it was full of snow. And I'm like, shit, I almost started my car like that. So, technically, Mila has tried to kill me. Yeah, I mean, that's the thing. No, thank you. No, thank you, Twister. I appreciate it, dude. Get a new one and come talk to me. Sorry if anybody really loves that song, but that's that's it's not gonna make the video. J. Cole can make the video, but they're not they they're not making the video. That's that's all I'm gonna say.